Hello, my fellow coding adventurers, and welcome to the Flutter series. Before we dive headfirst into the world of Flutter, let's take a moment to realize that even the best of us can't escape the age-old question. What the heck is Flutter, and why are we here? We're here to learn how to use Flutter. But first, let's understand what Flutter is and why on earth we're developing with it. I mean, there's a reason we're not on a tropical beach sipping cocktails, right? Today's session is all about unraveling the mysteries of Flutter and figuring out what makes it stand out in the crowded world of software development. So let's embark on this epic journey. First things first, let's get an overview of what's in store for this session. In today's class, we will answer the questions like, what is Flutter? And why, oh why, are we using it? So why Flutter? It's a question that's been haunting our dreams since the dawn of this session. We'll find out what makes Flutter better than its competition. After all, we need a reason to choose Flutter over, well, not Flutter. But hang on, let's not get too serious here. In the grand scheme of things, this series might not save the world, but it might just save your coding career. Now, let's take a closer look at Flutter. It's like taking a magnifying glass to inspect a new superhero costume. You know, you've got to understand every detail before deciding if you want to be a part of the Hero League. But what is Flutter, you ask? Well, Flutter is like the Swiss army knife of development. It helps you create apps for Android, iOS, the web, and even desktop. It's like having one tool to rule them all. But don't worry, we'll dive deeper into that in a bit. And what's this native cross-development you're hearing about? It's like saying, you can have your cake and eat it too. We'll break it down for you soon. Now, let's talk about cross-platform development. It's like having one outfit for all occasions. Think about it. You design one code base and use it on Android, iOS, web, and desktop. You're basically a coding fashionista. But why go cross-platform? Well, it's because we want our apps to reach as many users as possible, just like a blockbuster movie premiere. So, if the users are on desktop, mobile, or both, we want to be there too. And when it comes to mobile, we're talking Android and iOS. It's like choosing between pizza or a burger. Most people go with Android, but iOS has its own cult following. So we're targeting both the food court of mobile development. Now, to target all these platforms individually, you'd need to learn different languages and create separate code bases. That's like trying to juggle multiple balls, but with different rules for each ball. But Flutter, Flutter is the master of all trades. You write code once and it works on all these platforms. It's like having a universal remote control for your development. So here's the secret sauce of cross-platform development. One code base, multiple platforms. It's like ordering one meal and getting it served in different restaurants around the world. That's the beauty of Flutter, where one code base rules them all. With Flutter, you code once and conquer all the relevant platforms, reaching as many users as possible. So it's not just about development, it's about world domination, one line of code at a time. All right, so you're probably thinking, what is Flutter? Well, let me tell you, Flutter is like the Swiss army knife of the development world. It's the tool that lets you build apps for Android, iOS, the web, and even desktop. It's the one tool to rule them all. But wait, what's this native cross-platform you're hearing about? It's like saying you can have your cake and eat it too. We'll break it down for you in a moment. But first, let's appreciate the fact that even the best of us need a bit of explanation. So why should we care about cross-platform development? Well, it's like having one outfit for all occasions. You design one code base and use it on Android, iOS, the web, and desktop. You're basically a coding fashionista ready for any platform. And when we say cross-platform, we mean developing code that can be executed on multiple platforms or operating environments. It's like having a universal remote control for your development. You code once and it works everywhere. But what if I told you that you don't have to learn multiple languages for different platforms? It's like learning how to speak only one language and having the power to create a code base that can be executed on all platforms. No need to be multilingual in the coding world. So what's native? Well, native development is like going back to your hometown. It's where you were born. In the development world, it means creating an app tailored specifically for one platform. Using the platform's native languages and tools, it's like speaking the local dialect. For example, developing an Android app means you need to be fluent in Java or Kotlin. You'll also need to know the local customs of XML for UI design and navigate the streets of Android Studio. And then there's the hybrid solution, which is like a mix of your favorite fast food items. It's a blend of both native and web solutions. It's like creating a dish that can be enjoyed at the fancy restaurant and on the go. This hybrid approach often involves using web-based languages like HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. 
to create a code that can work as both a website and a mobile app. It's like turning your website into an app without breaking a sweat. So to sum it up, Flutter is your universal tool for app development, while native development is like speaking the local dialect and hybrid development is the best of both worlds. It's a bit like ordering your favorite meal and having it served in different restaurants around the world. Bon appétit, my coding friends. All right, folks, so far we've been on a journey through the world of Flutter, native, cross-platform, and hybrid development. It's like we're exploring different neighborhoods in the coding universe. Now, let's talk about cross-platform development. It's like having one code base for all your devices. It's like using the same passport to enter multiple countries. A real coding globetrotter. Write the code once and reuse it on different platforms. It's like being an eco-friendly developer, reducing code waste. Now, let's clear up the confusion. I mean, who wouldn't be confused when diving into native, cross-platform, and hybrid development all at once? It's like trying to understand why cats love boxes so much. It's a mystery. In the native world, you've got Android Studio and Xcode. It's like saying, if you want to speak the language of Android, you better brush up on your Java or Kotlin. And for the iPhone crowd, you've got to be besties with Xcode. Now, in the hybrid world, you'll find Visual Studio and Ionic. It's like combining your favorite ice cream flavors. You get the best of both worlds. You can create apps that work on multiple platforms without breaking a sweat. And then the star of our show, cross-platform. It's like the Avengers of Development Tools. Flutter and React Native are like our superheroes. Saving the day by letting us write code once and use it everywhere. But why should you choose Flutter over its counterparts? Well, let me show you a simple diagram to make it crystal clear. It's like having a treasure map, but instead of gold, it leads you to the world of Flutter. You see, Flutter doesn't depend on native development libraries or components. It's like a magician who doesn't need any fancy props. It creates its magic with its own rendering engine. And this reduces the hassle of dealing with native components. It's like coding without the drama. So there you have it, Flutter. The hero of cross-platform development and a real magician in the world of UI development. It's like having a superpower that simplifies complex UI designs. Now, you might be wondering why you should choose Flutter over other tools. Well, my friends, that's a story for another day. But remember with Flutter, you're not just developing apps. You're creating a symphony of code that plays on all platforms. It's like being the conductor of a coding orchestra. So stay tuned and we'll uncover the benefits of Flutter as our journey continues. All right. Folks, we've covered the basics of why Flutter is the superhero of the development world, but let's sprinkle in a little humor to keep things interesting. Now, imagine you're in a situation where you're juggling web development, app development, and desktop software development, it's like being a one-person circus, and you're juggling websites, apps, and desktop software like a pro. But guess what? Flutter swoops in and says, hey, why not just write one code base and use it everywhere? No more juggling acts, just one code base to rule them all. So let's dive into the benefits of Flutter. And boy, there are some goodies in store. Increased time to market speed. It's like upgrading from a snail's pace to the speed of a rocket. Your clients will love you for it because time is money and you're saving them a ton of it. Reduced code development time. Think of it as streamlining your work process. You're not just working smarter, you're working quicker. Time is of the essence, my friends. The potential to go beyond the app. Flutter doesn't just stop at apps. You can take your code and conquer the world of mobile, Android, iPhone, desktop, and even websites. It's like having a magic wand that works everywhere. Same UI and business logic in all platforms. Consistency is key and Flutter delivers. Your users will experience the same UI and logic, whether they're on a mobile, desktop, or web. It's like magic. Custom animated UI of any complexity available. Want to add a touch of pizzazz to your UI? Flutter lets you create animations as complex as a Rube Goldberg machine. The only limit is your imagination. Simple platform specific logic implementation. No need for complicated acrobatics. Flutter simplifies the process of dealing with different platforms. So you see, Flutter is not just another development tool. It's a time saving, code reducing, universe conquering, consistency keeping, animation wizard of a tool. It's like a Swiss army knife for developers. And there you have it. The fabulous benefits of Flutter Stay tuned for more coding adventures and wisdom in the world of development. Until next time, thank you and keep coding. Hey there, if you enjoyed the video and found it helpful, please consider giving it a thumbs up. Your support and encouragement mean the world to us. And that little thumbs up is like a virtual high five that keeps us motivated to create more content like this. And if you wanna stay in the loop for more exciting content, 
don't forget to hit that subscribe button. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we release new videos, tutorials, and tips to make your learning experience even better 